Equestrians. I'm Lisa, the Budget Equestrian. Welcome back to another video. And today I wanted to share with you guys a little bit about what I've been doing since I haven't been able to ride my horses. And at first this was really frustrating. I was really worried. I was very concerned that I wouldn't be able to do much with my horses while I was recovering after surgery. Well, I am four weeks after surgery. I've been given the all clear to groom my horses, bathe my horses, play with my horses. So I have been making the most of that time and I wanted to share that with you guys today. So sometimes for whatever reason, we may not be able to ride. Either we're post-op from surgery, something happened, can't ride, whatever the reason is, you can't ride your horse. But all hope is not lost. There are a lot of different things that you can do with your horse that does not entail riding. And the good part about this is when you are able to ride, your riding will actually improve. activities that I'm working on with my horses right now is building our relationship and it's going to help when I actually do get to get back into the saddle. I've been working a lot with Frisbee because Frisbee is a lot quieter than Ethan so Frisbee is the one I will be riding in a couple of weeks when I get to six weeks after surgery. That's when my doctor said I can ride so I can't wait a couple more weeks to go and then I get to get back into the saddle. Hopefully that gives you some ideas of what you can do with your horse if you're unable to ride for whatever reason. And if you'd like to learn more about my DIY projects, product reviews, and how you can be a budget equestrian, be sure to click the little subscribe icon so you don't miss anything. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.